training we're going to discuss the PX editor. This is one of the most underused features uh, in the Tritium systems uh, that I've seen to date. Customers have a lot of power with this PX editor and what PX editor is is the graphic editing software. Um, it can be used either through a workbench tool like what I'm looking at right here or it can also be done exactly the same way in the browser. Uh, so just from a web browser that that capability is there for customers. And I'm going to just run through a scenario of the most common type of problem uh, we run into uh, that usually results in either a service call or some kind of service charge from most companies that's a very simple fix for owners to do. So we're going to start on this on this particular project here and we're going to go to the main level floor plan. And in most cases on most systems uh, when they're designed uh, we design them using the equipment name because that is really the only true uh, piece of information that is not going to change as the building ages or gets sold or changed uh, changed hands or even office space is changed. So we're going to just take for example VVT23. VVT23 is not a very descriptive name and we may move someone into that office by the name of uh, Sally or whatever the name may be. Clicking this view toggle edit mode and in your web browser, you would see it right here uh, on a line right real similar, just like this, and it would go into this hatched pattern like what you're seeing. It's as simple as double-clicking and typing in a new name, and we're going to call this Sally. And it's a little bit small. I can't see it all, so I can drag it out. I can center it. I can move it over wherever I want to. And unchecking, that is... That is uh, the, one of the best features of being able to do live database editing uh, with the Tritium Niagara system. You can do it for programming, and uh, again, one of the best features is you can update graphics at any time with room number changes, room name changes, and it doesn't require any special tools. It can all be done directly through your web browser. If you have any more questions, please feel free to contact Woodman Controls. Thank you.